public want to address this application? Hi, uh, my name is uh, Michael Nolte. Uh, good evening, uh, Commissioners. My name is Michael Nolte. I'm the Executive Director of Alliance for a Better District 6. I was going to read all this, but after listening to uh, what was just said by the police, I want to say something totally different. I think it's uh, appalling that the police department comes at the last minute with a bunch of conditions to a business that's already gone through several community processes, several community meetings, and been hammered out at several times, and then decides at the last minute to dump on a business and say, um, we're going to hold you hostage uh, until you uh, agree with us. And I think this is very egregious. Um, this, is not, this is not the first time I've seen uh, police officers come to per permit hearings. Um, there was, it happened at one of your last meetings where uh, 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 the same thing happened. And I think that this, uh, it, well, I'll even mention it was King of Thai. So, you know, um, th this, is not, this, is, this is not acceptable behavior of the police. Um, as a matter of fact, I plan on having OCC come to my next community meeting, and I'm going to start addressing some of these issues. I think that it's important that there should be some transparency. Um, if uh, the police want these kinds of conditions, they should be made more aware of it. The community needs to be made more, more aware of it and not come in at the last minute and, and basically uh, bulldoze uh, conditions onto a, a, a business that's trying to survive and actually improve the community and make a difference. Um, um, these particular business uh, business owners actually come to the table, mitigated with the neighborhood, and approved improved their uh, their um, uh, business, uh, which I can't say necessarily for all businesses, but I mean in this particular case, they are, they actually have uh, walked the walk and talked the talk. So. Um, if you're going to um, do something about this, I would um, think use your wisdom hat and say, well, we, we want do we want this business to operate or we want this business to fail? So uh, I'm here to say that uh, the Alliance for Better District 6, as well as the Tennis Association Coalition and whole partner groups of people that are, were involved in the uh, planning process to get their uh, conditional use want to see this business um, may uh, happen and would obviously uh, uh, do want their extended um, hour permit to be approved, um, but not with a bunch of conditions to tie their hands that uh, make it impossible for them to operate. Um, so uh, I'll let you as wisdom um, caregivers of the uh, Entertainment Commission think about what's good and wise. Thanks. Thank you.